Welcome to Zoological World today we are discuss about frilled shark. Frilled sharks are a primitive looking species that resemble an eel. They are considered living fossils because of their primitive traits, like their brown color, long body, and placement of their jaws. Frilled sharks spend most of their time deep beneath the surface of the water. They are most commonly found at depths between 390 and 4,200 feet below the surface. Frilled sharks were given their name because of the six pairs of gills along their throat that look like ruffled collars. Incredible frilled shark facts. The gestation period of a frilled shark may be up to 42 months. The southern African frilled shark species was just classified as a separate species in 2009. Female frilled sharks are larger than males. Frilled sharks have more than 25 rows of teeth. The first video of a frilled shark wasn't recorded until 2004. Frilled shark classification and scientific name The frilled shark's scientific name is Chlamydicelicus anguineus. Chlamydicelicus is Greek. Chlamy means frill in Greek. Idos means cape. And selicus means shark. Anguineus is a Latin word that means eel-like or snake-like. These sharks are part of the Chondrichthys class and the Chlamydicelachidae family. There are two frilled shark species. In addition to the Chlamydicelicus anguineus, there is also the Chlamydicelicus africana, or the southern African frilled shark. These two species of frilled sharks are the only species in the Chlamydicelachidae family. Frilled sharks are also called frill gilled sharks, scaffold sharks, silk sharks, Greenland sharks, frill sharks, fringe sharks, and lizard sharks. Frilled shark appearance The body of these sharks actually looks quite similar to an eel or snake. They have a very primitive appearance with a long and slender body. They have a flat head with a rounded snout. The fins on these sharks are much smaller than those you'd see on other species of sharks. They also have a ruffled throat and six pairs of gills, that look similar to collars. These collar-looking gills are the reason the frilled shark was given his name. Most other shark species have jaws that are underneath their heads. However, a frilled shark's jaws are actually at the end of their head. They have over 25 rows of teeth with approximately 300 teeth total. Frilled shark distribution, population, and habitat These sharks primarily live in the deeper waters in the ocean. They can be found along the outer continental shelf and upper to middle continental shelf. While they will go to the surface of the water at night to hunt for food, most of the rest of their time is spent along the floor of the ocean. They are usually found between 390 and 4,200 feet beneath the surface, but may go as deep as 5,150 feet beneath the surface. These sharks can be found in many different areas around the globe. A few places they can be found include in Suruga Bay in Japan, off the coasts of New Zealand, Australia, and Hawaii. They are also found in the Pacific Ocean between California and Chile and in the Atlantic Ocean between Norway and Namibia. The Southern African frilled shark is found in the Indian Ocean near South Africa. These sharks engage in spatial separation within their habitats. Spatial separation is when the members of a species create their own microhabitat where they spend their time. This is because they are unable to inhabit the same area as another shark for any real length of time. Since these sharks live in the deep waters of the ocean, scientists still have a lot to learn about the species. There currently is not an estimate related to the total population of them or whether their numbers are increasing or decreasing. This shark currently has a conservation status of least concern, but since so little is known about the species it is unclear how threatened they are. These sharks can be caught in fishing nets which may have a greater impact on the population of the species since they have such a long gestation period. 